All right, we're talking about the heat. Seems like we need to go ahead and get back to weather because uh, I think we actually got a little lucky with the cool off with the rain. We did. Um, we had some drier air coming anyways, but uh, I think most people will take how quickly it cooled down this afternoon because of all of that rain. Now, thankfully, most of that rain is out of the area, leaving us with a pretty quiet and dry evening and overnight hours. 86 today in Fayetteville. These temperatures reached before all of that rain started falling from the sky about mid afternoon or so. Uh, really only a four, four and a half hour period of that really heavy rain. Then it kind of fizzled out as the sun set. Record high of 92 set back on this day in 2011. Fort Smith, things are nice and quiet as well. You got up to 90 degrees today, four degrees above the average, which is 86, not too far off your record. Set back whole oh, way back in 1911 of 98 degrees. Now, here's a look at the satellite and radar picture. You can see any remaining shower activity really starting to diminish in coverage and intensity. Just some showers south of Mena. Winds have shifted out of the northeast and it's kind of shoving this boundary back toward the west that is responsible for all of this unsettled mess. You can see all the heavy rain across uh, central portions of Louisiana from Oakdale up through Alexandria and northwest toward the Shreveport area. But for us, things will be nice and quiet the rest of the evening. There's a look at temperatures across northwest Arkansas, upper 60s for the most part, really not too bad, a pretty comfortable evening. Uh, upper 60s and lower 70s uh, for the River Valley at this hour. Dew points, they are gonna continue to slowly fall thanks to this northeasterly push of winds. You can see the dew point in Mountain Home is just 55. That's very comfortable but still lower 60s and a few upper 60s there toward the River Valley. So you go through the rest of the night, we'll be nice and quiet, waking up tomorrow morning, no issues. We still have a very small chance tomorrow, not nearly what it was today, of a couple of afternoon showers, maybe a couple of weak thunderstorms that'll slide in from the northeast toward the southwest. Again, about two, three o'clock in the afternoon through sunset, once we get the sunset, that all fades away for the most part. And then waking up Monday morning, no issues as well. Lows tonight in the 60s, about where we should be for our average lows. And we'll be near our average highs. Maybe it's slightly above average tomorrow. And pretty, you know, lots of sunshine tomorrow as well. UV index of 9.1. So put on that sunscreen just to be safe so you don't get burned. Uh, extended forecast is active, uh, especially Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. More afternoon showers and storms that'll pop up. Those chances lessen as we get toward the second half of the week. River Valley, pretty much the same thing. Can't roll out a shower or a storm any day early next week before we start to quiet down toward the end of the week. Stay with us. Meredith is back with another Hog Wild Sports update after the break.